Wise. Wow! That looks good! Thanks. But this one isn't for you. It's a surprise present for Mrs. Rora. It's her birthday today. May I have one teensy slice? If she gets yeah. one, so should I. Don't worry. Huh? I'll bake for you, too. Yahoo! <laughs> Yeah? Well, I'd like to trade Mom's pie for some of Mrs. Rora's chocolate chip cookies. Hey, me too, me too. <laughs> Cab's supposed to deliver the pie, but he's running a little late. It's going to get huh? cold. I can take it to her. Huh? Really? <laughs> it's not too far. Please, let me go. All right. And while you're gone, I'll bake a pie for you, okay? Yeah. And I'm going to come oh. too. What do you mean? It's huh? too far, Susie. You just said it isn't far. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay, kids. Uh, Wish Mrs. Rora a happy birthday uh, for me. Uh, Mom, I don't want to take her. If Susie listens to you, there won't be any problems. Right, Kevin? Uh, no. Will you listen to Kevin? Yes! <laughs> Go straight to the main road, Kevin. Yeah. Uh, Susie, hurry up, will ya? The pie's gonna get cold. I'm trying. Huh? Kevin, where are you going? This is the shortcut to Mrs. Rora's. But Mom told us to go straight to the main road. It's okay. I know the way better than Mom. Are you sure? Sure, I'm sure. Okay, Cab, you're <sighs> all set. I feel like new, Amber. Oh. oh, boy. Gotta run an errand for Kevin's mom. Huh? Bye, Cab. We'll see you again soon. Whoa! This street is weird. Why do the cars come so close? Well, see, this is kind of a road, okay? Oh. Oh. Okay, pal, back up. I came in first. What are you talking uh, about? I was here uh, first. You uh, back up. This is you scary. Uh, don't don't worry about them, in. Susie. Do We're do almost there. I think this way might be faster. Kevin, I'll take it for a while. Oh, thanks, Susie. What happened, Cab? Holy! <laughs> you okay, Susie? That pie was for Mrs. Rora! Oh, it's okay. <laughs> I'm sure that Mrs. Rora will be very happy that both of you are safe. Cab, I'm surprised. You know you need to be extra careful and watch for pedestrians in alleys like this. I'm sorry. It's huh? all my fault, Polly. Kevin, Susie, there are some simple rules you should always follow when you walk in places where there's no sidewalk, and I'd like to teach them to you. Okay. First, always walk along the side of the road, not in the middle. If you walk in the middle, you can't see cars coming behind you, and that's dangerous. Second, always stop and move to the side when cars want to get by. Walk after they pass. Drivers can't always see you. Always stop and look carefully before crossing. Never run out. Third, when you walk on a narrow road, don't walk side by side. Always walk in a line. And it's not a good idea to carry anything on the side the cars are on. If one gets too close, a little bump can cause a big accident. So follow the rules, and even a walk down a narrow road can be a lot safer for everybody. Okay, Polly. That's great, but... The pie's ruined. Oh, yeah. Oh, I know. Mom's baking another huh? one. That's right. <laughs> Mrs. Rora, we're here. Oh, what a surprise. Happy birthday, Happy Mrs. Mrs. Rora. How oh, sweet. This is a pie for you from my mom. Oh, well, isn't that thoughtful? Come on in. I think I have something for you, too. <laughs> Chip cookies!
These are my favorite cookies in the whole world! They're my favorite cookies in the whole entire universe! <laughs> well, I must admit, I like them too. <laughs> Never forget to turn off the gas. Mom, what are you doing? <gasps> Strawberries? <laughs> We're making strawberry jam today. It's so good on bread. Yay, awesome! Ooh, strawberries, yeah! Stop that! These are for strawberry jam. Come on, you've got plenty of them there. Children, stop fighting and be good until the jam's ready, all right? Yes. <laughs> Yummy jam, jam, jam! Mom, I'm about to <laughs> die of hunger. It's almost done. <sighs> Just have to let it simmer down. So, can I have a little taste? Back up! Hey, what's your problem? Jam is for eating on huh? bread. Huh? It's traditional. Uh -huh. Lucy, fetch some bread from the living room. Yes, Mom. <laughs> hey. Huh? Oh. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Mommy, look. <gasps> <laughs> My bread! Bad dog! Lucy, we'll get more bread! Don't cry! <laughs> Lucy, want me to carry the bread? No! I have to protect it from the bad, naughty dog! <laughs> he probably ate the jam while we were gone! Oh no! <gasps> Mom, hurry! Buddy's eating all the jam! <laughs> Relax, Lucy. The jam is still up on the stove, so Buddy can't get it. <gasps> Children, I think I forgot to turn the stove off. What happens when you don't turn it off? The jam might start to burn, and there could be a fire. <gasps> oh, the jam will burn up? The jam isn't the problem. The whole house could burn down. Oh. Uh-oh! Oh, it's an apple <laughs> Mom, hurry! Yeah, I'm coming. <laughs> hey! Hey! Uh, miss, are you all right uh, down there? I'm just fine, thanks. <laughs> We're almost home! <gasps> Come on! Hurry up, Mom! <gasps> Kids, just follow your mom! <laughs> <laughs> This way's blocked, too. Come on! Oh, Mom, what'll happen if Buddy of our house burns down? Uh, <laughs> Buddy, I'm sorry I called you bad name. <laughs> no, that must not happen! Go, oh, Mom! Mom. <laughs> Here, this should work. <laughs> oh, huh? Come on, we're going home! You are really awesome, awesome Mom! Mom. Uh, 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 Look out, Lucy! Uh, uh, Lucy! Uh, 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 oh. uh, Look, we're almost there, Mom! Just a little bit further now. Peter! Uh, Peter, boy. is something wrong? But he's all by himself at home. And I didn't remember to turn off the stove. Let's get there. Buddy! 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 Huh? Huh? Uh, hi. What's going on? Buddy! <laughs> it's a good thing Robert turned off the stove, or it could have been a real disaster. Sorry, Roy. I should have been more careful. I'll give you a couple of safety tips for using the stove. When the stove is in use, never leave it unattended. The pot might overheat and start a fire, or the ingredients may overflow and cause a gas leak. Also, before using the stove, make sure that there's no smell of gas in the air. If you start the stove when there is a gas leak, it could explode, so please always check. Also, make sure that the fire is fully lit. 
If the knob is turned while the fire is off, the gas could leak. Lastly, always remember to turn off the gas valve after using the stove. If you're worried you might forget, installing a gas timer might be a helpful precaution. We will. Thank you, Roy. Hey, Mom, can we please have some jam? Yes. <laughs> yeah. But where is the jam? <laughs> I left it on the table. Uh, oh, 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 buddy! buddy. <laughs> Show up. Heave ho. Careful. All done. Now it's safe, Cleamy. Thank you so much. <laughs> huh? Jin, something wrong? Looks like there's another beehive that needs to be moved. This one's at Cindy's house. All right. We'll go right away. Helly, mm -hmm. let's get to Cindy's house. You bet. <laughs> Goodbye, you guys. <laughs> Ta-da! Whoa! Super yum! Mm, it's the new double chocolate dream donut. I had to line up so early in the morning to get them. Ah! Oh, oh, oh. ah it's a bee! <laughs> Just a tiny bee. Nothing to be scared of. Uh, Peter, look there! Look where? <laughs> when on earth did that big beehive get there? My donut! They're only selling that kind for one day! <sighs> Fine! Bees or not, that's my donut! Johnny! Johnny. Double chocolate dream! Johnny, you all right? Well, at least I managed to rescue one. <laughs> no! Oh. Ah, I have an idea that might work. Easy does it. Little bit more. Just uh, hurry up! Back uh, off! Uh, Let me do it! Ha! Uh, you got it! Awesome! Uh, 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 close the door! Uh, hurry! Uh, oh, my donut! It's gone forever! Oh. <gasps> uh, Aha! Mm -hmm. Guys, I need your help. Huh. Mm -hmm. huh. Uh. Boxman, ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> Operation Rescue Donuts. Peter's the man. I have eyes on the donuts, moving deep into enemy territory. Three seconds until donut rescue. Two seconds. One second. Mission success! Yahoo! He did it! <laughs> now I walk out. Huh? Oh! Oh! Go! Go away! Huh? Run for your lives! Huh? What's that sound? Bees are chasing the kids! Johnny! Hey, kids! I'm coming! Are you all right? Nobody got stung? Yeah, we're okay. <laughs> we'll be happy to take the beehive. <sighs> Thanks, Thanks a lot. lot, children. Let me tell you what to do if you ever run into bees. Listen up. When you find bees, don't try to get rid of them yourselves. Just quietly move away. If you find a beehive, 
Do not touch it. Just call the authorities and it will be removed safely. If bees chase you, cover your head and lie down. Protect your body. If a bee stings you, don't touch it and go to the nearest hospital for treatment. You can remember that, right? Sure, sure Amber, Amber, of, of course. course. I think it's time to eat some donuts, you guys. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm starving. <laughs> There's another bee! <laughs> no, my double chocolate dream! Don't run between cars. <laughs> Take that! Oh, yeah? Stop! <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> That's so cold. Mm. Oh, I'm really, really sorry, Mr. Musty. <laughs> oh, never mind. Now, let's see. I'm looking for Lewis's new house. Oh, I know where his house is. Over there. The house with the blue roof. Ah, <sighs> I see it now. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye, Mr. Musty. Huh? <laughs> hey, stop! Yeah, got That's you. not fair! <laughs> you snooze, you uh, lose! Stop! <laughs> Uh-oh, I'm running out of ammo. <laughs> oh, My oh, turn! Oh, oh, come on! Yeah! Stop! No! How do you like that? Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah! Uh, uh. Oh, look! There are so many visitors here. I hope I can find a space. <laughs> if you put that big sign in this small alley, it could block a driver's view and cause a bad accident. Oh, right! So sorry. I'll move it now, Polly. Good. Have a nice day. Huh? If you park right in front of the crosswalk, the children won't be able to see when they try to cross the street. Huh? Right. I'll move now. Good. It's safe to cross. Thank you. Uh, um, it looks like uh, you're lost. Can I help you? Yeah? Oh, please! Where could he be? <laughs> This'll be great! Aha! I've got you now! <laughs> all the cars. Okay, Doug. I know you're here. <laughs> hmm. You want the house with the blue roof? I see. Thank you, Polly. Bye. See you later. Bye-bye. Huh? Look at all the cars. So many parked on the street. and Doug. I can't believe you two just ran out into the road. We're, We're really, really sorry, sorry, Polly. Did you know if you run in between parked cars, you're 18 times more likely to get into an accident? It's very dangerous. Did you say 18 times? Right. If small children like you pop out from between parked cars, it's nearly impossible for drivers to see you in time, and you could wind up getting hit. So whenever you have to walk out onto a road, if you're in a parking lot or near cars at all, you must look around first 
and then walk slowly and carefully. Even if you're at a crosswalk, you must never, ever run out in front of a bus or in between cars. Also, since you never know when cars are going to move, you shouldn't ever play around them even if they're parked. We hear you, Polly. <laughs> So we finally meet. It's time for a duel, partner. You're on. I'm gonna count up to three, then we draw. All right, partner. A one, two, three! <laughs> so how do you like my monster hey, water gun, Pilgrim? That's not fair, Come dog. Come here, you Come on, Come on dog. <laughs> How to call 911. You guys, guess huh? what I heard? There was the most amazing shooting star last night. I saw it myself. Yeah, there was this crazy bright light oh. everywhere. Light mm -hmm. everywhere? Yeah, that's right. I've never seen a meteor. What do you mm. think they look like? I heard it's just a rock that falls from oh. space. Just a rock? No way! It's got to be sparkly, like a Super Bowl! The three of us are going to get to the bottom of this, you guys. Are you ready? Ready! ready. Magic dowsing rods to find its energy. A jumbo sausage, because we're out here for hours and I might get hungry! Alien communicator ham radio! Wait, how are any of those going to help us find a shooting star? Peter, you just brought sticks, and I'm pretty sure you can't eat those. Heh, <laughs> check this out. Ha! Let's go, Super Dowsing Rods. Hmm, I felt it. This way, let's go. Uh, <gasps> is he feeling okay? Who knows? Hmm. Are you sure this is how to get to the star? Of course it is. I totally know the way. Uh. 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 So, this is still the way? We'll be there in no time. Oh. Over here! <laughs> so, you're still 100% sure? Yes, guys. I keep telling you I got this. <laughs> no, my sausage! <laughs> What is that? It's really dark in here now. But I know I saw something. Charles, hmm. is there a light over there? Hmm. Right here. <laughs> the shooting star! <laughs> wow. wow! That's gotta be it. Huh? Ah! We should call 911. But I don't have a phone or anything. Uh, oh, that's right. Your radio uh, thingy. Rescue squad, Jin speaking. There's a fire. Uh, we don't know what to do. Uh, Where is it? Uh, Where are you guys? Uh, it's an old cabin in the middle of the woods. Uh, but I've never been here, so I'm not really sure. OK, remain calm and don't panic. Describe what's around. Do you remember how you got there? Got, got here? Um, uh, well, at one point the road forked and we went to the left, and later we crossed the river on a log. There was a cliff where we fell off. And that's how we found this cabin that's on fire. Hmm. Okay. Heads up, you guys. Huh? There's oh. been a fire reported in the woods in a cabin. Hmm. I need you to get there. Hmm. Sending location now. Huh. Got, got it! <laughs> Helly, I'll head through the forest. You tell me where to go. You got it. Huh? Roy, head left. Thank you. Roy, Helly. Everybody safe? Yeah, we're okay. okay. <laughs> 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 This could have been a lot worse, but thanks to you kids, it was contained. Oh. 
That's, That's great. great. So anytime you see a fire, use a cell phone, pay phone, or any other phone and call 911. Always remain as calm as possible and describe exactly where the fire is. If the fire is somewhere you're unfamiliar with, look around for landmarks. Landmarks can be big buildings, libraries, schools, big trees, intersections, roundabouts, ponds, lakes, subway stations, or bus stops. This is so firefighters can find the fire more easily. <laughs> you understand? Yeah, Roy. Awesome. Why are you guys all the way out here anyway? Oh, oh the, the shooting, shooting star. star. Oh, no. Hmm. It would still be inside. Oh. <laughs> huh? Ta-da. I remembered oh. to bring it out. Oh. Yay, yeah, we, we got, got a shooting, shooting star. star. You guys found the meteorite? That's awesome. Everyone's been talking about that. Well done, guys. We, we found, found it. it. <laughs> I see perils. <laughs> Woohoo! Antarctic, Antarctic base, base complete. And what does every expedition need? It needs a brave and brilliant captain. Captain? Duh. And since I'm the bravest and smartest of us all, it should be me. <laughs> sure, whatever. Mm -hmm. It's cold. Aren't you coming in? Hey! Not till you admit I'm the captain. Oh, wow. It's going to keep snowing all day. This could be the year's biggest snowfall. Ah, oh, cool. Huh? We should make forts and snow helicopters. Helly, on snowy days, there tend to be more accidents than usual. And that means we have to be on alert to help people. But I'm sure you knew all that already. Huh, course I did, silly. <laughs> Maybe you need a refresher quiz. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, huh? There's a snow monster. Huh? It's a 12-legged elephant yeti. A what? I want to see. Uh, wow, uh, there's a polar bear passing. Come on, it's my turn. And an army of emperor penguins. So cool. Peter! Huh? Whoa. Charles, what's uh, that? This is my constellation projector. It projects the night sky. Cool, right? Yeah. It's pretty. Uh, <sighs> this is what we'd really see in Antarctica. Well, we'd see auroras, too. Hey, guys, let's go to Antarctica. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> huh? Is that you, Johnny? Oh, 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 what's going oh. on? Oh, no, the exit's covered in snow. Huh? <gasps> Our view outside's huh? blocked, too. It's all black. Oh. <sighs> ah! Peter! Peter! <gasps> We uh, might be in trouble, you guys. Uh, help! Thanks for your help. Mm -hmm. I was really <laughs> stuck. Spooky, whenever it snows, roads can get really slippery with ice, so it's important to go slower than you usually would. I sure will. <laughs> huh? Hi, Jin. We need your help. <sighs> the kids were playing on Apple Street, but they haven't come back yet. Dispatch the team right now. Understood. <laughs> this is the very last of our food supply. Oh, it's frozen solid. We're all frozen solid. What if we're not discovered for years? Like dinosaurs. Oh, oh, we're, we're done, we're done, done for. for. Kids. Huh? <gasps> Rescue, Rescue team. team. We're in here. Peter. Johnny. Charles. Listen. If you hear us, yell. Down, Down here. Can, Can you hear? us at all. This is the end. Huh? Oh, oh, wait a sec. Uh, We're uh, down here. Come uh, on. Hello. Oh, what's that? <gasps> I see them. <clears throat> all right, stand back. Hmm. <clears throat> 
Hey, kids, you okay? Ah! <laughs> Roy! <laughs> Thank goodness you're all safe. Thank, Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> when the snow is heavy, there are some things to remember. In winter, pay attention to weather forecasts to see how bad the snow is expected to be. On days with extra heavy snowfall, it's best to stay inside. And if you do go outside, remember to wear your gloves, a scarf, warm shoes, and something to cover your ears. Always tell your family where you're going and when you'll be back. If something happens and you need help, try as many ways as possible to signal for help. While you wait for help, move around to keep your body temperature warm and remain calm. Hmm, got it. We'll, we'll do, do our, our best. best. You guys! Huh? Huh? It just stopped snowing, so snowball fight? Really? really? All right, snowball fight! fight. Well, <laughs> we do what we can. Hmm? <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> Don't turn back when you cross the road. <laughs> huh? A cat! Were you abandoned? Kevin, hmm. we've got a green light! Hurry up! Okay. Meow. Oh, I can't. Doug, wait uh, up! Uh, Kevin, look out! Uh, hey, watch uh, it! I'm sorry! There's a growing number of accidents recently with children at crosswalks. What do you think mm. we should do? I'll go and double check that all the green lights are working properly. Good. Amber, mm -hmm. let's go together. We'll go out mm. to the crosswalks and guide the children as they cross the street. <laughs> <laughs> Soft like a ninja. There. Kevin, Mommy says come to supper. Yeah. Uh, all right. Huh? What's uh, that? Uh, it's nothing. Huh? Uh, uh, a cat? Uh, it's so uh, cute! <laughs> shh! Mom huh? cannot find out. Kevin? Huh? Susie? Uh, okay, we're coming! Susie? Uh, Precious! Oh. Thanks for dinner! Uh, thanks, uh, Mommy! Huh? Uh, uh, um, okay? Meow, 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 meow. Go on and uh, eat, Elizabeth. Uh, meow. Elizabeth is not her name. <laughs> hey, Elizabeth. Meow. Aren't you adorable? Huh? Meow. Susie, what's going on? Elizabeth is missing! Mm -hmm. Huh? Elizabeth? 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 Where are you? I think she must have gotten outside. Kevin? Poor Elizabeth! Elizabeth? Where are you, Elizabeth? Huh? Come back! Huh? Hey, Susie, wait! Elizabeth? Huh? Wait for me! Amber, let's see how things look at the 7th Street crosswalk. Sure. Huh? Huh? Oh. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Susie! Uh, huh? I found her! <laughs> uh, Elizabeth! Uh, huh? Huh? <laughs> out of my way! Huh? No, Susie! <laughs> look out! Huh? Look out! Yeah! Watch out! <laughs> no! Elizabeth! That was dangerous, oh. Susie. Thanks for saving us, Polly. Susie, you have to learn that it's very, very dangerous to turn back when you're crossing the road. I didn't know. Okay, 
Both of you pay attention and I will teach you the proper way of getting across the road safely. Are you both listening? Uh -huh. uh huh. You need to be very careful because there are a lot of cars driving on the road. You must make sure all the cars are at a complete stop, even after the light says it's okay for you to walk. Once you cross the road, you must not turn around because cars might not see you coming back. <laughs> when you have to go back, go all the way to the other side and wait for the next light. And while you're crossing the road, you should not pick things up from the ground, play games, read books, or look anywhere but the street. Okay! okay. <laughs> and if the don't walk light is flashing, then it's a good idea to wait for the next light. <laughs> okay, Polly! <Okay. Holly. laughs> Quiet. Okay, where have the two of you been? Huh? What is that, Susie? Oh my goodness! Oh, it's a kitty! <laughs> oh, I'm gonna call you Mittens! <laughs> Her name's Elizabeth! I like Mittens! <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh, you can't change your name! <laughs> Never ever play with fire! Guys, over there is the cabbage! And there's the lettuce! And the yummy spinach! Wow! Look at that! Wow! What are they up to over there? <laughs> and if I do this... What's going on? Ah, you scared me. Charles, come huh. here and check this out. Peter's burning stuff with his magnifying glass. Huh? Peter, you should never play with fire. But it isn't yeah. play. It's a science mm -hmm. experiment about harnessing the sun's power. Look, oh. it worked. Whoa. Uh, isn't that fire too big? Oh. Uh. <laughs> 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 Okay, students, huh? gather up. Oh. Right, come on. <laughs> Goodbye, children. Come back soon. <laughs> What's wrong with the light? Ah, fire! Did you hear? Tracky's <gasps> house caught on fire. <gasps> For real? Goodness, what happened? They had to call in the rescue team and everything. It was pretty bad. Oh, dear. Uh, Is Tracky going to be okay? Uh, uh, uh. Do you think we caused the fire at Tracky's? It's weird. Our little fire was out for sure. Listen, guys, we need to be honest and tell the teacher about the fire. What? what? Charles, are you kidding? If we tell the teacher, then all our families will find out, and then they'll tell the rescue team. Oh. Then we'll end up in jail or worse. Oh, no. Uh, jail? I can't go to prison. So the whole thing about what we did at Trackies will be our secret and we'll never tell. Um, um but... but... Cleanie, did you hear? Huh? There was a bad fire out at Tracky's place, and Tracky got hurt. Really? And was he hurt bad? Well, he's lying in bed wrapped in bandages. Huh? I'm sorry, but I have to confess what we've done. What? No oh. way! You promised you wouldn't tell, remember? I'm with Johnny. Tracky got hurt and it's all because of us. Guys, please don't tell. Huh? huh? Uh, huh? Phew. <sighs> then it's settled. No one says a word, right? Uh-huh. I'm back. Hi, Peter. Did you hear? There was a fire at Tracky's. Uh, Mom, I'm tired. I'm going to bed. I wonder what's bothering him. <laughs> uh, Peter, you dropped this on the huh? floor. Ah, uh, give it here. Uh. Huh? 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 Peter? Huh? I'm so disappointed that you caused the fire. Cindy, I didn't. You set Tracky's house on fire. Huh? Huh? I never no, knew no. our son was like that. Uh, Dad! Oh, uh, Mom! It isn't true! Peter! Huh? Johnny! Charles! Oh. Why are you in there? Uh, 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 uh. Peter! How could you have done this to good old Tracky? 
Look what you did! Draggy, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it's all my fault! Now, what are you guys telling us? We were playing with fire and we didn't mean it, but the fire at Trackies was our fault. It's our fault Tracky got hurt. We didn't know what was going to happen, though. We're so sorry. So very sorry. Uh, huh? uh what? Mm. Jin, got some fresh fruit here. Huh? 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 Tracky, are you okay? <gasps> guys, the mm. fire at Tracky's house was caused by a short mm. circuit. And so I just burned huh? my hand a little bit. <laughs> We're really glad, glad you didn't, didn't get badly hurt, hurt Tracky. Tracky. Uh, hang on. Exactly what did you guys do at Tracky's garage? Um, well... Children, playing with fire is incredibly dangerous. You must never do it again. You should never play with matches, lighters, candles, or magnifying glasses for fun. It could lead to a big fire. Stuff like plastic, paper, toilet paper, and trees are extremely flammable. So be careful, because little fires can turn into big fires fast. And if a fire does break out, always remember, don't worry about getting in trouble. Just call 911 right away. <sighs> hmm, Roy, it'll, it'll never, never happen again. again. I can see you boys are sorry, and that's good. But you should still be punished. So, write a 10-page apology letter. 10, ten pages? pages? But we're, we're so, so sorry, Jin! <laughs> <laughs>for a better day. Robert, hmm? you packed everything? I've packed the lunchbox and I've got the camera. <laughs> and the mat? Uh-oh, I'll be right back, sweetheart. <sighs> Every single time. <sighs> huh? <sighs> Peter, do you have a cold? Huh? Uh, no, I'm better than ever. Really? Yeah, for sure. Here, let me get that. Huh? I'll take it. See, totally mm. fine. <laughs> Why do I feel so dizzy? I'm sure I'll be fine once we get there. <sighs> and now we've got the mat. <laughs> Peter! Mm -hmm. huh? Somebody help! Peter! Peter! Huh? Uh, uh, what happened? Uh, oh no! Uh, uh, Watch out! Uh, 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 Peter! 
Peter! Oh. Oh. He's got a nasty cold. I gave him some medicine for the fever. Thank, Thank you, you, Amber. Amber. Oh, Broomsland. Broomsland. <laughs> Just let him rest a few days until he's better. Okay. Uh. Ah. It feels so good to be outside. Good morning. Huh? Hello, Peter. Hello, Amber. Hello, Amber. So how are you feeling? After sleeping like you said, I feel much better. <laughs> I don't want to be sick ever again. <laughs> you can help prevent colds by doing a few oh. simple things. Really? If there's a cold going around, it's a good idea to wear a mask to keep the virus from spreading. Washing your hands often and brushing your teeth will help eliminate any germs you may have come into contact with. If you're not dressed for the weather, your immune system can weaken. Be sure to dress warmly on cold days. If you cough or sneeze into your hands, you'll spread the virus to anything you touch. Cover your mouth with the inside of your elbow or a tissue. If you do catch a cold, get lots of rest and drink plenty of fluid. Understand? Yes, Amber. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, Mom, can we go to Broomsland right now? You're sure you're well? Way sure! I'm 100%! Hachoo! Maybe it's more like 80. Uh, no, Mom! I'm all better! Achoo! Achoo! Uh, it's just allergies! <laughs> <laughs> oh.